everybody. Sorry for the hiatus. I've been having some real technical difficulties, but I finally got this working again. Unfortunately, I lost my save file, but the good thing is, I definitely know what I'm doing now. I've gotten a lot of hints. I can navigate better. So I'm going to do a much more interactive and informative Let's Play this time around. So I'm going to go ahead and set a timer on my phone for one hour. This episode is going to be one hour long. So let's see. Set a timer for an hour. So I can go ahead and check up on it if I want to. And we are going to get started with a new game here. I do have eloquence still. So let's actually change audio settings. Change audio settings here. Audio settings menu. SFX volume slider 85. Music volume slider 85. SF rate on a beat and volume slider 85. Dialogue volume slider 85. Rate on a beat 80, 77, 66, 55, 50, 40, 40, 35, 30, 35. Dialogue volume slider 85. Sappy speech volume slider 100. Sappy speech voice slider Microsoft Anna. HRTF slider on. Save changes. Change the save. Name and change preferences. Preferences. Speech mode. Screen reader support group code. Automatically enhance. Use battle log. Automatically enhance story dialog. Off. Use battle log. Automatically enhance. On. Use battle log. On. Difficult. Use battle log. On. Off. Okay. That's what I want. Main menu. Change audio settings. Sound. Continue. Start a new adventure. Alright, we're gonna start a new adventure here. Select your gender. Email. We're gonna be a male. Enter the name of your new character. We're just going to be Chris, of course. Please choose your starting attributes. Press space for a detailed description of the selected attributes. Strength 6. Press left slider to adjust value. Press enter to confirm. We want... 7, 8. You have 22 left as 9. You have 10. You have 20 left as 10. Our strength here up to 10. 11, 12. You have 18 left as 10. Dexterity 6. Press left and right arrows to adjust value. Press enter to dexterity measures your fine motor skills. It affects your damage and accuracy with ranged weapons and your chance of parrying melee attacks. I'm... 7, 8. You have 16 left as 10. Agility 6. Press left and right arrows to adjust agility measures your quickness and mobility. It affects the frequency with which you can act during battle and your ability to dodge physical attacks. Hmm... 7, 8, you have 14 left as constitution 6. Press left and right air constitution measures your physical vitality. It affects your maximum hit points and stamina. Yeah, that's what I want to really. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. You have 5 left to spend. 16, 7, 18. You have 2 left to spend. Intelligence 6. Press left and right intelligence measures your mental acuity and alertness. It affects your maximum amount of accuracy with magical skills. 7, you have willpower 6. Press left and right air willpower measures your strength of mind and force of personality. It affects the damage and effectiveness of magical skills as well as your ability to resist magical attack. Strength 12. Press left and right arrows to dexterity 8. Press left and right dexterity measures your fine motor skills. It affects your damage and accuracy with ranged weapons and your chance of parrying melee attacks. Agility 8. Press left and right arrows to adjust 9. You have 0 left to spend. Okay, there we go. I'm happy with that. So, um, as you can tell, this is going to be a power character. Um, it's what's called, I'm going to call him, uh, I call it a uh, let me explain. So I used to play a lot of RPGs back on the PS2, and um, our power character who used, who was used to soak up damage and deal massive hits was called Tank, because in battle, tanks usually uh, roll ahead of the rest of the soldiers so they can absorb gunfire with their heavy armor and use their big cannons to lay down lots of damage, so that's why I call it a tank. So that's what I'm creating here. Let's go. Are you satisfied with these attributes? Yes. Yes, I am. Please make the difficulty. Difficulty can be changed to be normal. We're going to play on normal. Greetings, traveler. Welcome to Farhaven. As a matter of procedure, I have to ask what weapons you're carrying. And like I said, I'm going to be a melee character. Yes, my sword. The true warrior needs nothing else. So we're going to choose our sword. So long as you can defend yourself. Hmm, I'm going to defend myself here. Defend myself from what? Uh, and in this game, you have um, a couple of options of how you can respond. Um, you can be nice, you can be so-so, you can be selfish, or you can just be uh, a butthole. So I'm going to have my character be pretty nice for the first time around. I might play this a couple more times as different builds. Uh, there's no need to be alarmed. Well, actually, I suppose there is. Lately, this area hasn't been very safe. Uh, we do what we can, but every now and then, something... Look out! As you turn to see the gate standing ajar behind you, two smiling wolves leap through it, okay? Alright, so wolves just jump through the... Uh through the south gate of uh, Farhaven. So we're gonna go ahead and fight him here. Okay. Draw your sword, traveler. We can't let them enter the city. So we're gonna be fighting with this guard here. And it's really cool because this guard actually has something called um, shield ally. And what he's gonna do is since we're new, he's gonna uh, use that to protect us, uh, hopefully here in this battle if it doesn't end too quickly. And he will soak up some of the damage for us. So let's go. They won't get past me. Combat is handled on a turn-by-turn basis. When it is your turn to attack, you will be able to select from a list of skills that your character has learned. Factors including your speed and the speed of the attack will affect how quickly it is executed after being selected. Press the number keys and space bar to get more detailed information about the skill. You can also get detailed information about your allies and your enemies by selecting Examine Party or Examine Enemies. Okay. Alright, so basically, in a, in a nutshell, this is an RPG, and usually, um, combat is not real-time. You have menus that you can choose from, 
and it flip flops between the enemy's turn to attack or do whatever they need to do and your turn to attack so you can do whatever you need to do. So when it's your turn, you can choose um, different attacks. You can choose to use items like potions to restore healing or magic or stamina, um, uh, mana, whatever you, need, whatever you want to call it. Um, so that's that's kind of how, how it works and what they're explaining here. You can encounter two enemies. Choose a skill for Chris attack. All right, so I've encountered two enemies here. So one of them for each of us. There's a wolf on the left and a wolf on the right. So here's my simple attack. Warrior Strike. A Warrior Strike, which is a more powerful attack, but that uses more stamina. It deals more damage. Use item. And here's use item. Rest. Rest, which means you take a break and it recovers some stamina and mana. Examine party. You can examine your party, so you can see how much health each person has, if it has any friction. Examine, examine your enemies here, they're spools. Retreat. And you can retreat and run from the enemy, which we do not want to do here, because this is the end of battle, it probably will us. Attack. So, I'm going to show you guys what a regular attack is and how much damage it deals. We're going to um, actually attack this left wolf here. <laughs> Okay. So my attack did 15 damage. I'm gonna do warrior strike now. Okay, so the wolf is slightly wounded. That wolf's at full health. He just used shield ally on me. I missed. Let's see. Okay, so the first hit did 15 damage, the second hit did 23 damage. I'm not going to use special attacks very much right now, because I still need to power up, and it doesn't use that much... I mean, it doesn't increase damage that much for all the stamina it uses. So we're going to do regular attacks. Okay, he's almost dead. There we go, he's dead. Alright, I'm gonna examine our party here. Okay, one here. 100, 149 health. Okay, I'm okay. Walter the guard. Walter. Walter. He's hurting a little, but we're okay. Attack. Attack on wolf. We're gonna get this wolf now. And since uh, Walter the guard has been attacking him already, this should be... Wolf. I'm gonna... wolf. Okay. He's using shield ally on me again. Okay. We're gonna use warrior strike. Use warrior strike. Through Battle's almost over. He missed. Okay. <laughs> There we go. That did it. Oh no, it didn't. One more. Warrior strike, man. It's too late. The fight's over. Hey. Oh no, I didn't kill him. What? Oh, he did a counter. Battle off. You won. I can see. Wolf health. Okay, we got a wolf health. I got 180 XP. Not bad. Both battle off. You won. Well fought, stranger. Those beasts won't be bothering anyone now. You seem to have a pet problem. To be honest, I'm not sure how much longer we can hold out. The city's been under almost constant attack for weeks now. We don't know why, or where the attacks are coming from. We do what we can to hold the line, but we're spread so thin. If someone could just find out what's causing the attacks and put a stop to it. Say, you're a pretty capable fighter. Maybe you could help. If I can help make the people of the city safer, I would gladly do so. That's a little too butt kissy. I'd be happy to do what I can. There we go. You should speak with Lord Adrianus. I'm sure he'll want to know you're helping us. Who is Lord Adrianus? Lord Adrianus is the governor of Farhaven. I'm sure it's been hard for him to see his city fall on such difficult times. Who what? I need some directions. Where can I find Lord Adrianus? He's probably in his manor in the northwest part of town. It's the large building past the fountain, on your left. And now I need to return to my patrol. Good fortune go with you, friend. Your quest log has been updated. To open your quest log and do your quest. Press control plus Q. Okay. Awesome. We got a new quest. So we gotta go find that guy. The guard's directions have added a new beacon to your map. As you discover new locations, they will be added to your beacon's list. Go to the beacon menu by pressing control plus D to get directions to discovered locations. Okay. Would you like to learn more about how to navigate? Yes. No. Enter in what's up road. Okay. Here we are in Farhaven. So I'm gonna kind of explain the controls a little bit. So you can um, strafe, which means moving uh, left and right without changing directions with the left. 
and right arrow keys. Dot, dot, nine. Hi, dog. Dot, dot, ten. You can press forward to go forward, back to go back, but if you want to change directions, you hold down shift, left, and the row one, and three, six, south, eight, eight, one, and the row two. There we go. So yeah. 20, 20, 20, 20. We want to press Control B. Go to our begin. Choose a beacon. Blacksmith. General store. Guard barracks. In a tavern. Temple. North gate. East gate. West gate. South gate. Adriana's Manor. There we go. North. All right, we gotta go north. And the north. 20, 20. We're facing north. Let's go. North. North. Let me. Pause menu. Save lowest sounds. Change audio. Change preference. Change sounds. Reference. Change audio settings. Audio settings. SFA radar. Dialog volume. Dialog volume. Radar. 30, 20, 20, 20, 15. There we go. Dial sappy sappy speech rate voice slider HRTF save change music I'll save change change to save pause men North 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 Hi Fountain Entering Fountain North. Entering North South Road North North Just running North Hi person Entering intersection Look I'll talk to anybody right now North Entering North South Road West Head 16 Walls South Enter North South Road 1 North 6 Leaving West. North South Road we are. We made it, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and create a new save file. Which file will you save to? Create a new save file. Enter the name of your new save file. L T two. Game save. Which file will you save to? Create a new save file. Cancel. Okay. We got to find Lord Adriana. So let's start looking around. Entrance hall wall two. Enter entrance leaving entrance hall. Wall seven. Wall one. Wall seven. Door zero. Okay, there's a door here. Entering kitchen. This container is empty. Door Even kitchen. kitchen. Wall zero. Wall one. Door four. Where am I? Door two. Door four. I think that's the dining hall. Wall zero, door zero. Wall zero, door one, wall one, door nine. Gallery door fifteen. Wall one. What the? Gallery door. Oh, there's someone over there. Sally, yes. the Is there a problem, citizen? I press Control A to snap to her, and then press Enter to talk to her. Is there anything I can do to help out? A frail thing like you. I think you'd better leave the work to us. Is there anything I can do to help out? What can you tell me about the town? I can tell you that it's difficult to protect, especially when people are always asking you silly questions. Smart ass. Is there any, what can you, where can I buy items to heal myself? There's an old woman who runs a potion stand just north of the blacksmith's shop. You might also check in the general store or with Father Ignatius in the temple. Is there, what can, where can I be going now? Stay safe, citizen. Gallery door 11, guest room door 1. Gallery. Wall one. Cat wall. Door seven. Guess we're outside. Sally, the guard spot. Wall six. Hi, Sally. F six. City wall. Wall six. F zero. Wall six. Small gate zero. North west watchtower door six. Yes. Is there a problem, citizen? Is there anything I can do to help out? A frail thing like you. I think you'd better leave the work to us. People are jerks around. Is there what? Where can I do? I'll be going now. Stay safe. City wall zero. Adrian, yes. the guard one. Head one, as far as I can see, 30. Head three, 26. Small gate, zero. Head five, 10. Head 29. Wall five. Head 12. Wall five. Head, head 21. What was that? Head four. Head yeah, I thought I had some. Head six. Yeah. Walls. When Adriana's three, When Adriana's one. Yes, can I help you? Who are you? My name is Gwen Adrianus. Lord Adrianus is my father. I'm looking for Lord Adrianus. Father should be in his study. You must have passed it coming down the hall. 
Okay, so we gotta find the study inside. I'm looking for Lord Adrianus. What are you doing? Me? Oh, just practicing some combat techniques. Father wishes I wouldn't, but a girl has to be able to defend herself, especially these days. I'm looking for Lord Adrianus. What are you doing? I better be going. It was nice to meet you. Okay, Which finally was able to read an LP1. LP2. Game save. Head <laughs> 5. City Wall. Yeah, that, that's a really, really. LP1 is a really old save file, and I thought it'd be. Head 17. City Wall. Head 4. Wall 5. Do the beacon. Adrianus Manor. Head 15. Head 4. Head. Head 1. Small gate 20. Wall 1. Door 0. Okay, cool. Web bedroom, door 0. Door 6. Wall 0. Door 6. Door 0. Wall 0. Door 0. Wall 0. Door 0. Entering kitchen. Leaving kitchen. Wall 0. Wall 1. Door 4. Gallery door 15. Door 3. Wall 0. Door 3. Entering dining hall. Leaving dining hall. Wall 0. Dining hall 08. Wall, wall 1. Dining hall 08. Wall 8. Entering dining hall. Wall 2. Door 2. Leaving dining hall. Wall 16. Wall, wall 6. Armory lock door 1. Wall 9. Guest room door 1. Wall 5. Door 7. Wall 0. Door, door 0. Wall 0. Door 0. Wall 0. What's in here? Door 0. Enter the kitchen. Leave the kitchen. Wall 0. Wall 1. Okay, so we've been down this hallway before. Kitchen 1 4. Wall 4. I'm just gonna Entering kitchen. Looking around, guys, sorry. Leaving kitchen. Door 5. Wall 15. Entering hall 2 10. Door 10. Wall 2. Wait, what was that? Logic door 1. Wall 4. Wall 1. Wall 5. Door 7. Gallery door 1. Entering gallery. Leaving gallery. Door 6. Alchemy lab door. Enter an alchemy lab. This container is empty. Door 2. Wall 0. Door 2. Study door 0. Oh, there's a study. Enter an alchemy Lord Adriana 3. Can I help you? Bookcase 1. Bookcase 2. You can get additional information about an item's characteristics and effects using the number 12 The noble houses of Arcane and 1 of 2. The tale of Titus Adriana 2 of 2. Wall 3. Bookcase 2. Lord Adriana 2. So, there you are at last. You were expecting me? I make a point of knowing what goes on within my city's walls. When I heard about your defense of the South Gate, well, naturally, I've been looking forward to meeting you. Oh, so word travels fast without the internet. That's interesting. I was glad to be of service. The guard told me everything. I understand you want to help with the defense of the city. That's right. It's not right for your people to live in fear. Excellent. We can always use more able-bodied guards. Um, guards? Your guards can only hold out for so long. I intend to find out what's causing these attacks. There we go. You, you mean leave the city walls? Yes, sir. N no, you mustn't. Why not? I want to help. Yes, of course. But the lands beyond are not safe. It's too dangerous. I am willing to take that risk. I can see there's no dissuading you. Very well. The attacks are coming from Silvershade Mine to the west, the graveyard to the east, and the forest of Deepwood north of town. If you want to stop them, I'm afraid you will have to survive all three areas. Then I just get started. Thank you for your help. May good fortune go with you. I'm afraid you'll need it. Wall 1. Wall 2. Let's go. Bookcase 1. Wall 0. Wall 2. Where's wall 0. Door. 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 Study door 2. Leaving study. Okay, let's go. Wall 17. Wall zero. 
Wall six. Door zero. Wall zero. Door seventy. Door at the opposite bedroom. Door zero. Door four. Wall one. Door four. Wall one. Service quarters. Door one. Door ten. Wall sixteen. Entrance hall. Entering entrance hall. Yeah, let's get it back. Here. Leave the entrance hall. Okay. Oh, hi. Hey, wait. I heard you speak. Okay. Hey, wait. I heard you speaking to father. Are you really going to leave the city? That's right. Why? Sure he is. If you're going, I want to come with you. Hey, she's feeling us, guys. I appreciate the offer, but it's much too dangerous. Ah, might you be much help? Why would you want to come with me? I'm going crazy cooped up here, and it's not fair. Other people are putting their lives on the line, but I love this city. It's my home. I know I can help protect it. I just want the chance to try. Hey, she's trying to chill. Okay, she a ride or die. What makes you think your father will let you come with me? What makes you think he can stop me? She's like, I don't give it. You have a mind of your own. I like that. So, you'll let me come with you? It will be enough. I'd be glad of the company. Like I have a choice. Come on. To be honest, I'm a little afraid to say no. You won't regret this, I promise. When Adriana says join your party, she has traded as a badly witch and can also get you better prices from shop owners if she's in your party. When Gwen is traveling with you, you can talk with her by pressing control plus C, okay? Sweet! Let's go ahead and save. Which file will use LP LP2? Game save. Oh yeah. Chris has 81 health. Gwen Adriana has 97 health. I need some potions. You have 100 gold. Alright, so I'm gonna go to the general store. Choose a beacon, Adriana's matter. Set custom, blacksmith, general guard barracks, general store. So I get some potions. Wall one, door one. Entering North South Road. South. Intersection South. two four. Entering South. intersection. Entering North South Road. South. 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 Enter leaving North South Road. South. Entering East West Road. South. Enter East West Road two. General. Leaving East West Road. Entering General Store. Wall three. Madeline Greetings, too. Traveler. Whatever you're looking for, I'm sure I have it. Okay. So let's talk to her. What can you tell me about the town? Barhaven is a good home. Silvershade Mine brings in good money, and the woods to the north are beautiful. Of course, nobody leaves town these days. I do. You do? I thought you looked like the adventurous type. Say, maybe you could help me out. With everyone afraid to leave the city walls, walls most of my supply, supply lines have been cut off. Gone. off. Pretty soon, my entire inventory will be gone. I'd be happy to help replenish your inventory if that's what you're asking. Wonderful! I'll compensate you for your trouble, of course. I used to get a steady supply of wolf pelts from hunters in Deepwood Forest, but now my supply of furs and leather is almost gone. Could you bring me 20 wolf pelts? I'll I give you a fair price Let me for them. My business here and I'll start gathering them. How else can I help you? Do you carry specific types of goods? How else can I help you? Do you, what do you have for sale? I'll be going now. What do you have for sale? You can buy and sell items from shopkeepers. Press tab to cycle between the merchants, buy and sell menus, and then enter to select an item to buy or sell. You can gather information about items using the number keys. Okay. You have I won't find gold, better variety gold. anywhere in Farhaven. Iron War Fine Cudgel, 70 gold. Weapon Rating, 18. Iron War Hammer, 235 gold. Iron Spear, 70 gold. Iron Greaves, 95 Cures, 45 Greaves, 28 gold. Initiates Amulet, 17. Initiates Staff, 18. Initiates Rain of Shielding, Weak Potion of Sorcery, Weak Potion of Greater Healing, 35 gold. How many will you buy? Three. You don't have enough gold. You have 100 gold. Weak potion of greater healing. 35 gold. How many will two? You have 30 gold. Weak potion of greater healing. 35 high cudgel. 70 gold. Iron war hammer. Iron spear. Iron breeze. High cures. 41 gold. Iron breeze. 97 gold. High cures. 41 high breeze. 28 gold. Initiate amulet. 17 gold. Initiate staff. 8 initiate high armor rating. 6. Come back again soon. Select a menu. Search for details. Quest log. Inventory menu. Equip menu. From the base equipment menu, you can switch between. Okay. Chris's equipment sheet. Head slot. Traveler's clothes and body slot. Canvas pants and leg slot. Equip Chris's high breeze. 2 of 2. Equip Chris's legs. Unequip high breeze. Canvas pants. 2 armor rating. 5. Unequip armor rating. 6. Chris's equipment sheet. High breeze and leg slot. If you need help, whatever you're looking for, I'm sure I have it. Do you care what do you have for style? Be going now. What do you have? You have you won't gold. Find you have better gold. variety pants, anywhere in Farhaven. Potion of greater healing. Eight gold. Canvas pants. Three gold. You have five gold. Three meat potion of greater healing. Come back again I soon. Did that. Pause menu. Change audio set. All right. So we have uh, three places. If you need help go finding right anything, let's go. Just let Wall me please. know. General. Sword. Need a general sword. So um. Which I will LP can save. We have a couple of places we can go, but um, well, I'm going to go to the graveyard first for a good reason. One, because there are good enemies there that will help us level up fast, and two, because there is someone there that I want to find. But first, we need to go to the temple. Choose a beacon, general store, guard buried in the temple. Entering East West Road. Fountain 4 
Yes. Echoing fountain. Echoing yes. Echoing my child. You were led here for a reason. Tell me what you seek. Is there anything I can do to help? Ah. I can see you have a brave and generous spirit. Thank you. There is a task that you might do, but it could place you in danger. That's okay, we're bad. If it will help, I'm willing to take that risk. I'll do it if the reward's large enough. Danger, forget it, let's talk about something else. Danger, forget it, I'm out of danger. I'll do it if, if it will help, I'm willing to take that risk. Then you are truly sent from the divine. One of my brethren, a priestess from this temple, ventured into the graveyard to the east. She sought to purge it of the dark influence that now hangs upon it, but I fear that some evil has befallen her. Please, if your path takes you into that awful place, will you try to discover her fate? I will give you what reward I can. If she is alive and I have read the defender, I will. I'll be sure to tell you if I learn anything. Sure. Thank you, my child. What can you tell me about Farhaven? Do you have any advice for what can you tell me about Farhaven? The recent hard times have shaken many people's faith. Some think this is a punishment from the divine for some secret sin. Others say it is a test. To be honest, I'm not sure which to believe. What can you do? Do you have any advice I need healing? What do you have for sale? I'll be going now. May the peace of the divine go with you. Alright guys, so yeah, we have our quest there, so we're gonna go to the graveyard. Cast your cares to the beach, temple, north gate, east gate, west gate. I believe that's... East gate. East gate? Let me see. Select a menu, the menu. Fine. He will show you the path. Then you're okay. Current quest, the good shepherd. Supply lines, a hero's call. In order to save Farhaven, I must venture in the Silver Shade Mine to the west, the graveyard to the east, and the forest of Deepwood to... Yes. And seek to divide... Choose a beacon, east west gate, east gate. West. Temple wall three. Holy altar two. Cast your cares west. upon the divine... Seek the healing of the divine when your situation is more dire. West. Temple wall north three. West. West. Mountain temple. South. North south road one four. South. Mountain. South. South. East. East. Here we go, guys. East. My tongue hurts. East. Gotta get some more money, bro. I'm sorry. South. East gate eight zero. Southwest. East west road one three. East west road three. As far as I can see, east gate one. East gate. Press the enter key to enter party. Which file will LT one? Game save. Oops. Which file LT LT two? Game save. Pause menu. Change audio set. Here we are. Entering back. So we're here in the graveyard. Do we have any beacons? Choose a beacon. Party in the east Set custom beacon. Party in the east Okay, let's see if we can find anybody. We can get in some fights. Enter back zero. Graveyard fence two. Open grave four. Leave in back. Back five seven. Grave. And enter pack seven. Uh-oh. Leaving pack. This place is free. Pack 1460. Pack pack. Alright, we got a fight. Oh, bats. Counter four enemies. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Oh, god, bats. Warriors, attack. Use attack on blue pack. Full health. Choose a skill for Glenn Adriana. Attack. Firebolt. Use firebolt on blue pack. Full health. That'll work good on enemies. On these enemies. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Get down. 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 Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Use attack on blue pad. Seriously wounded. Pad. Hold the pad. Seriously pad. Hold the pad. Hold the pad. Seriously wounded. Pad. Hold the pad. Pad. Seriously. Choose a skill for Glenn Adriana. Attack. Firebolt. Use firebolt on blue pad. Messing this up. Oh, Messing this up. Glenn. Choose 
Soon the silver to examine enemies, examine parties. Last three numbers, 61 of 97 bells. Oh. Chris, 48 of 149 bells. Oh, it hurt me. Choose a skill for Chris, but repeat and examine progress. Use items. Which item will you use? Free meat potion of greater healing one of three. Use meat potion of greater healing on the choose a skill for Gwen Ariana's attack. Firebolt. Use firebolt on blue. Fat at full belt. Fat. Seriously wounded. Oh, my God. It's got it. It's probably coming. Okay. Nice. Damage. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Use attack on blue. Fat at full belt. Choose a skill for Gwen Ariana's firebolt. Use firebolt on blue. 13 damage. 17 damage. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Repeat and examine arrest. Use item. Which item will you use? Use the potion of greater healing. Use the potion of greater healing. Seriously wounded. Hey. One of your party members are wounded. If their health drops to zero, they will be unable to fight. Use the restore health. Among the combat scams, using healing skills or potions. Choose items to use at all potions. Okay. Chris has reached level two. Gwen has reached level two. One of your party members has leveled up. Getting leveled up. You gain attribute points to increase your character stats. Add extra key points to upgrade your skills. Spend key points. Press control plus L to go to the level up screen. Okay. All right. So we both leveled up from that. Okay. Let's go ahead and heal up. Use the in a comprehensive list or a list sorted by type. Navigate between the list using the tab and shift plus tab keys. Use the number keys and space bar to get more information about items. If an item can be used, you can select it with the enter key. Okay. Inventory. Two week potion of greater healing one to four. Use the potion of great when Adriana's. This won't do any good. Chris. This won't do any good. Inventory. Two week. Oh yeah, we. Chris has 156 health. When Adriana's has 102 health. That's awesome. When we level up, our health replenishes. Cool. Level up, Chris. Level two warrior. Level up, Chris. Level two warrior. Set attributes. Upgrade skills. Skills can be upgraded by spending expertise points. Use the left and right arrows to view the different ranks of skills you can upgrade, and use the number keys to gather information about the skills. Some skills are not upgradable, but purchasing them can unlock new skills and abilities. Okay. Okay. Upgrade skills. Chris has one expertise. Ranged attack. One expertise. Hmm. Enhanced endurance. Two expertise. Ranged attack. One expertise. I definitely want a ranged attack for flying enemies because I can't be all melee all the time. Purchase skill for one expertise. Purchase upgrade skills. Chris has zero expertise. Oh, Enhanced no. endurance. Two expertise. Level of Chris, set attributes. One point available, assign attributes. Strength 12. Press left and right arrows to adjust value. Press dexterity 8, agility 9. Constitution 18. Press Let's left and right arrows to adjust value. Press enter to confirm. 19. You have zero left to spend. Are you sure you want to keep these changes? Level up Chris, level, level up Chris. Which file will you save? LP2. Can save. Let's go ahead Level up Chris, level 2. Gwen Adrianus, level up Gwen Adrianus, level 2 mage. Set attributes. Upgrade skills. Upgrade skills. Gwen Adrianus has one expertise. Ranged attack, one expertise. I spike, grant firebolt, grant two, one expertise. Purchase skill for one expertise, purchase skill, upgrade skills. Gwen Adrianus has zero expertise. Firebolt, grant three, one expertise. Level up, Gwen set attributes. One points available, assign attributes. Constitution nine, press left and right arrows to adjust ten. You have zero left to spend. Yeah, we want her HP up too. Are you sure you want to keep these changes? Yes. Level up, Gwen Adrianus, level, level up, Gwen. Which file will you save to? Create a new save file. LP1, LP2, can save. Because um, what we're going to do is we're going to uh, get their, their hit points up a little bit, and then we're going to start working on their offense. At one three, small gate four. Entering path. Leaving path. Graveyard fence 12, 23. Ancient road 23, 25. Thicket 25. At 1 3. Graveyard fence 4. Duck 5 13. Volcano mausoleum 23, 25. Magical barrier 25. Volcano mausoleum 26, 29. Volcano mausoleum door 29. At 5 7. Hedge 23. Map boundary 24. At Entering path. Hedge 23. Map boundary 24. End of path 0. Graveyard fence 1. As far as I can see 30. Hedge 12. End of path zero. Graveyard fence one. As far as I can see, thirty. Hedge south. Damn, right. You have encountered five enemies. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Oh, wait. <coughs> warrior strike. Use warrior strike on blue. Craze better at full health. Rat at full health. Craze better at rat at full rat at full. Craze better at full health. Craze better first. Choose a skill for Gwen at firebolt. Use firebolt on blue. Craze better at full health. Five damage. Five damage. One two damage. Oh shoot. Yeah. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Warriors. Use warriors. Use like a blue craze. Better crit. Use a skill for Gwen Adriana. Attack. Firebolt. Use firebolt on blue craze. Better crit. Rat. Rat. As craze. Better at full health. Oh, they cut. Five damage. Five damage. Choose a skill for Chris. Warriors. Use warriors. Like rat. Rat. As full craze. Better serious. Choose a skill for Gwen Adriana. Firebolt. Use firebolt on blue craze. Better serious. Wounded. I missed. Okay, he's, he's dead. Use attack on rat, 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 at full health. Yep, just rat. Use the skill for Gwen Fireball. Use Fireball on blue rat, at full health. Okay, okay. Five Choose the skill for a quick exam to examine party. Chris, 116 to 163 health. Gwen Adriana, 61 to 107 health. She's hurting a little, but she's okay. She'll last the fight. Choose the skill for Chris, attack. 
Turn back, traveler. Dark powers are at work here. Who are you? I am Alexia, a priestess and bearer of the Holy Light. Oh, I came her. here to dispel the evil forces, but they have proven too much for me. Alexia, Father Ignatius sent me to find you. I'm glad you're right. It wasn't my intent to cause him concern, but I can't leave. Not until this darkness is stopped. You're trying to accomplish the same thing. Maybe we can work together? I think it would be wise. I have knowledge that will help us, and you clearly possess the prowess in battle that I lack. What knowledge would that be? I've been tracking the source of the power that causes the dead to walk again. All of the dark magic in this place flows from the mausoleum of House Alcano. But there is a problem. The way is blocked by a magical barrier. The only way to dispel it is to find and neutralize the runestones that power it. I've heard of spells like that. Father and Cedric used to discuss them. Both of you have valuable expertise. Where will these runestones be located? They can't be far, but I don't believe we'll find them out in the open. Perhaps they are guarded within some of the other mausoleums. Once we find them, you will need me with you. Only I know the incantations to neutralize them. Then it's lucky I found you. Let's get going. In my experience, there is no such thing as luck. The Divine smiled on us today. That, I have no doubt. Sister Alexia has joined your party. She is a powerful healer with training and holy magic. When she is in your party, all restorative spells and potions will be 50% more effective. Press control plus C to speed with her when she's in your party. Okay. Hey. Which high LP, LP2. Okay. Let's go, boys. All right. So, we got to find some rune stones in... Duck on 2-9, Duke Stone 9. Duck on 110, Graveyard Fence 10, Pat 13, 15, Grave, Duck on 1, Full Condo Mausoleum Wall 17. Oak, Graveyard Fence 8, Graveyard Fence 8, Open Grave 12. Graveyard Fence 7, 2, Graveyard Fence 7, Open Grave, Full Condo Mausoleum Wall 16. Graveyard Fence 7, Fountain 18, 20, Fence 20, Map Boundary 21. Grave, Full Condo Mausoleum Wall 16. Grave, Graveyard Fence 7, Fence 20. You will encounter two enemies, choose a skill for Chris, attack. Warriors, use warriors, fight on new pad at full health. Choose a skill for Glenn Adrianus, attack. Fire pole, use fire pole on new pad at choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of field, light of field, hands 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 of field, when Chris wounded, use the skill for Chris attack. Use attack on Duke. Use the skill for Glenn Adrianus attack. Firebolt. Use firebolt on Duke. Pat seriously wounded. Thank you. Use the skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of healing. Light of purity. Hands of use. Hands of healing on Duke. Glenn Adrianus. Sister Alexia. Slightly. Use the skill for Chris attack. Use attack on Duke. Pat. Use the skill for Firebolt. You don't have enough mana. Attack. Use attack on Duke. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia, hands of healing, light of purity. Use item, light of purity, use light of purity on new pad at full health. Five damage. Seventeen damage. Twenty-one damage. Choose a skill for Chris, attack. Use attack on new, choose a skill for Glenn, use attack. Six damage. Three damage. Dang. Battle off, you won. The Dragon Ball Z Kamehameha beam. 
Chris Gage 136 XP, Matt Adam Gage 153 XP, Sister Alexia Gage 100. Which pile will save to create a new save? LTLT2, game save. Graveyard Fed 6, open grave 13. Graveyard Fed 0. Graveyard. Duck Pond 917, Graveyard Fed 17, Apple Watcher 1021, Edge 21, Map Boundary 22. Graveyard Fed 0, Edge 13, Map Boundary 14. Graveyard Fed 7, Pat 1012, Lumerio Mausoleum Wall 13. Duck Pond 9. Graveyard Fed 0. Graveyard Fed 0. Graveyard Fed 0. No. You will encounter two enemies. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Use attack on new rat at full health. Rat at full rat. Oh, full this is gonna be easy. Use attack on new rat. Full health. Use a skill for Sister Alexia. Cancel healing. Use a cancel healing on new Chris. Slightly wound. Glenn Adrianus. Slightly wound. Sister Alexia. This one too many good. Glenn Adrianus. Fourteen. Help recover. Okay. Use a skill for Sister Alexia. Cancel healing. Use a cancel healing on Chris. Sister Alexia at Chris. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Seventeen damage. 35 health, recover. Choose a skill for Chris, attack. Use attack on blue, choose a skill for Glenn Adrianus, but use attack on the choose a skill for Sister of Light of Purity. You don't have enough mana. Use item, rest, examine party, rest. Five damage. That was dead. 20 damage. Choose a skill for Chris, but use attack on choose a skill for Fire Hold. Use Fire Hold on blue, choose a skill for Sister Alexia, hands of healing. You don't have enough mana. Light of Purity. You don't have enough mana. Use item, rest. Choose a skill for Chris, attack. <laughs> She missed. Warrior strike. Attack. Use attack on the Judas Hill for Glenn Adrianus. Use the Judas Hill for Sister Alexi. Might abuse rest. Battle ball. You run. Chris gained 120 XP. Glenn Adrianus gained 96 XP. Sister Alexi gained 96 XP. Chris is each level 3. Alright, I know what I'm Hope the vampires, hope the vampires, layer 2. Hello, Gwen. I'm surprised to see you outside the city walls. It's nice to see you too, Hope. I take it you two know each other? Hope and I used to study combat together. <laughs> Those were the days. Gwen has real spirit, but I was always the better fighter. In your dreams, maybe. What are you doing out here? I heard you resigned your commission with the city guard. Once the attack started, Captain Lucian called all patrols back behind the walls. He wants us to lay back and guard the gates, but someone needs to get out here and hit the things where they live. Well, not live, but <laughs> you know what I mean. I feel exactly the same way. That's why I joined my friend here. If there's any way we can help, just ask. I'm in the middle of tracking down a major den of vampires. I can't leave the graveyard, but you can. I could use a favor, if you're willing. I'm happy to help. What do you need? My... Um, friend went down into the catacombs beneath the graveyard to hunt the undead. I haven't heard from him in a while. But I'm a little worried. Just tell me if you see him, so I know he's all right. Of course, I'll let you know if we come across him. Thank you. I have to get back to the hunt. Please, let me know if you find anything out. We'll do whatever we can. Your I quest? promise. Take care of yourself, Hope. You too, Gwen. Try and keep her out of trouble, will ya? You have my word. Keep your guard up, and watch the shadows. Which pile will use LLP and save? Let me check my vampire slayer run. Hope yeah. the vampire slayer run. Okay, we got about 17 minutes left. All right, let's go find some of the stones. See what we can. Volcano mausoleum wall 18. We can't go there. Duck pond 29. Great. Enter graveyard fence 0. Pat 2. Leading duck pond. Small gate 0. Enter in pack. Enter pack 13. Graveyard fence 14. Thicket 27. Enter pack 2. Graveyard fence 3. City wall 17. Head 21, map boundary 22, open. End of pack 0, graveyard fence 1, apple orchard 20, 30, as far as I can see 30. Head end of pack 2, city wall 17. Head 6, end of leaving pack. Head 6. Graveyard fence 0, apple orchard 19, 30, as far as I can see 30. Head 6. Graveyard fence. Graveyard fence 0, as graveyard fence 0, graveyard fence 0. Graveyard fence 0, graveyard fence 0, graveyard fence 0, as far as graveyard fence 0, graveyard fence 0, graveyard fence 0, head 4. Pack 1, 3, smoke. Hope the vampire slayer is going to battle. Oh, we got. You will encounter four enemies. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Use attack on Blue Rat at full health. Choose a skill for Glenn at Rihanna's attack. Use attack on Blue Rat at Judas Fire Hole. Use Fire Hole on Blue. Don't do Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of healing. Use hands of healing on Blue Chris at full health. Glenn at Rihanna's slightly wounded. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Use attack on Blue Rat at full health. Choose a skill for Glenn at Rihanna's attack. Use attack on Blue. 
Where's Hope? Where's Hope? Yeah, where's Hope? Through the Silver Sister Alexia, Hands of Healing, Light of Fury, Use Item. Light of Fury, Light of Fury, Not Blue Rat, Critically Wounded. Rat, Hope, Through the Silver Crisp, Attack. Use Attack on Blue Rat, Rat, Critically Wounded. Through the Silver Man, Attack on Fire Bowl, Use Attack on the Mother. Attack, Use Attack on Blue. 31 damage. 19 damage. 20 damage. Through the Silver Sister Alexia, Hands of Light of Fury, Use Attack on the Mother, Hands of Healing, Light Use Item. Rest. Through the Silver Crisp, Attack. Use Attack on Blue Rat, Seriously Wounded. Through the Silver Man, Attack on Attack. Use Attack on Blue. 19 damage. 39 damage. Do the silver sister Alexia, hands of healing. Light of fuse item, rest. Do the silver crisp attack. Warriors, stop you, warriors, fight. Do the silver fireball. You don't have enough on the attack. Do the attack on. 29 damage. Yeah. Do the silver sister Alexia, hands of healing. You don't have enough on light of fuse item, rest. Do the silver crisp attack. Do the attack on. Do the silver man at the end. Do the attack. 90 damage. Battle log, you won. This game, 228 XP. Glenn Adriana's game, 204 XP. Sister Alexia game, 192 XP. Play battles in magic. Glenn Adriana's game, level 3. Glenn Adriana's game, level 3. Sister Alexia, level 3. Sister Alexia, level 3. Level up, Glenn Adriana's level 3 mage. Level up, Glenn Adriana's upgrade skills. Upgrade skills. Glenn Adriana's has 1 expertise. Higher bold, rank 3. 1 expertise. Purchase skill for 1 expertise. Upgrade skills. Glenn Adriana's ice fire. Grand level up, Glenn set attributes. 1 points available. Assigned attributes. Constitution 10. Press left and right arrows. Intelligence 11. Press intelligence measures your mental acuity and alertness. It affects your maximum amount of accuracy with magical skills. Well, you have zero left to spend. Are you sure you want to keep these changes? Yes. Level up, Glenn Adrianus, level 3 mage, set attributes. Level up, Glenn Adrianus, left sister, Chris, level 4 sister, level 4 sister, Alexia, level 3 priest, set attributes. Upgrade skills, upgrade skills, sister, Alexia has 2 expertise, melee attack, 1 expertise. Ranged attack, 1 expertise, light of purity, rank 2, 1 expertise. Enhanced focus, 2 at pacifist, 2 expertise, exorcist, 2 at plus weapon, hands of healing, rank 2, 1 expertise. Purchase skill for 1 expertise, purchase skill for 1 expert, upgrade skill, sister Alexia has 1 expertise, hands of healing, rank 3, 1 expertise, purchase skill for 1 upgrade skill, sister Alexia has 0 expertise, hands of healing, rank 4, 1 expertise. Level up, sister Alexia, set attributes. 2 points available, assigned attributes, intelligence 14, press left and right, and intelligence measures your mental acuity and alertness, it affects your maximum amount of your accuracy with magical skills. 15, 16, you have 0 left to spend, are you sure you want to keep these changes? Level up, sister Alexia, level 3 priest, set attributes. Level up, sister Alexia. Which pile will use LPLP to stand safe? Enter in fact. Open grave, open grave, open grave, open grave, open grave, open grave. As far as I can see, 30. End of battle, catch 0, map boundary 1. End of battle. As far as I Open grave, open grave, open grave, open grave, open grave. End of battle, 0, Lanerno Mausoleum Wall 1. Leaving path. Catch 7, map boundary 8. Lanerno Mausoleum Wall 0. Path 8, catch. Okay, so there's Mausoleum. Mausoleum. City Wall 14. Graveyard Fence 1, Lanerno Mausoleum Wall 2. City Graveyard Fence 1, Lanerno Mausoleum Wall 2, City West. Graveyard Fence 1, Fetch 16, Map Boundary 17. Gotta find a way in. Graveyard Fence 0. Graveyard Fence 0. You will encounter 3 enemies. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Use attack on Blue Rat at full health. Choose a skill for Glen Adrianus. Attack. Use attack on Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of Peace. Use hands of Peace on Blue Chris at full Glen Adrianus. At full health. Sister Alexia at full health. Choose a slide of purity. Let's weapon. Use item. Let's weapon. Use let's weapon on Blue Sister Alexia at full Chris at full health. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of Light of Plus Weapon. It looks a holy blessing, causing the target's weapon to deal extra damage for a time. Okay. So it just it just deals extra. Use item. Rest. Five damage. Four damage. Twenty two damage. There we go. Choose. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Warriors. Use Warriors. Fight on Blue Rat Wounded. Choose a skill for Firebolt. Use Firebolt on Blue Rat Wounded. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of Use Hands of Healing on Blue Chris at full health. This won't do any damage. Honest, slightly wounded. Five damage. Thirty-five damage. Thirty-four damage. Twelve health recovered. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Stuff flying all over the battlefield. It's awesome. Warriors, fight. Use warriors, fight on blue rat. Seriously, wound. Choose a skill for Glen Adrianus. Firebolt. Use firebolt on blue rat. Full health. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of healing. Use hands of healing on blue Chris. Five damage. Four damage. Thirty-six damage. Hey. Thirty-three damage. Ten health recovered. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Use attack on blue rat. Seriously, wound. Choose a skill for Glen Adrianus. Attack. Use attack. Use a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands. Use hands for Glen Adrianus. Sister Alexia. Slightly. Like Hold it. Battle log, you won. Chris gained 168 XP. Glenn Adrianus gained 156 XP. Sister Alexia gained 144 XP. Which file will LP LP2? Game save. So we gotta find a way in here. City wall 2. Path 1 3. Graveyard fence 4. Oak City. Graveyard fence 0. Edge 15. Map boundary 16. City wall 2. 
Graveyard Fence 0, Fetch 15, Map Boundary 6. Graveyard Fence 0, Graveyard Fence. Fetch 12, 14, Graveyard. Enter it, Fetch Leaving Path. City Wall 15, Fetch 15, Map Boundary 16. City Path 1, 3, Graveyard Fence 20, 30, as far as I can see 30. City Wall. Where'd the most land go? Pat 1 3, Graveyard Fence 4, McGranis Mausoleum 11 14, McGranis Mausoleum door 14. Okay. Entering Pat. Leaving Pat. Graveyard Fence 0, Mac Graveyard Fence 0, Alfred McGranis is Grave 1. What will you take? McGranis Mile of T1 to 1. Stay Pat, Graveyard Fence 0, McGranis Mausoleum Wall 7. Okay. Graveyard Fence 0, Open Grave 2. You will encounter 3 enemies, choose a skill for Chris, attack. Use attack on Blue Raven, at full Raven, at full Raven, at full L. Raven, at full L. Choose a skill for Glen Adrian, fire hole, use fire hole on Blue, choose a skill for Sister Lake, Mile of Purity, use Mile of Purity. Nice. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Use healing on Blue Sister Alexia. Slightly wound Chris. Slightly wound Manatee Honest. Slightly wound. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Use attack on Blue Raven. Choose a skill for Manatee Honest. Fire Force. Use Fire Force. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of healing. Light of Fury. Use Light of Fury on Blue. Choose a skill for Chris. Use attack. Choose a skill. Fire Force. Use Fire Fetch 
You will encounter four enemies. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Warrior strike. You will warrior strike on blue pads at full health. Choose a skill for Gwen Adriana. Attack. Fire hold. Use fire hold on blue pads at full health. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of healing. Use hands of healing on blue Gwen Adriana. Slightly wound Sister Alexia. Slightly wound Chris. Slightly wound Sister Alexia. Okay, got one. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of healing. You don't have enough mana. Light of pure. Less weapon. Use item. Rest. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Warriors. Use warriors. Fight on blue pad. Attack. Choose a skill fireball. You don't have enough mana. Attack. Use attack on blue pad. Attack. Five damage. Five damage. Five damage. Five damage. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of healing. Light of pure. Less weapon. Use item. Rest. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack. Use attack on blue pad. Choose a skill for Gwen Adriana. Attack. Fireball. You don't have enough mana. Attack. Use attack on blue. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia. Hands of healing. Light of use. Let's use item. Rest. When? Choose a skill for Chris. Chris, examine party. Gwen Adriana's. 86 of 112 L. Sister Alexia. 66 of 97 L. Chris. 128 of 112. Choose a repeat. Examine and examine. Arrest. Use item. Which item will you use? Two weeks. Potion of greater healing. One of three. Use the potion of greater healing. Choose a skill for Gwen Adriana's. Attack. Use attack on blue pad. At full pad. At full L. 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 Pad.
Small eight zero. Great luck. Apple Orchard 1728, Edge 28, Map Boundary 29. Apple Orchard, Apple Orchard, the Tunnel. Zoomstone, Graveyard Fence 4, Fountain 16, Zoomstone 3. The Tunnel 411, Graveyard Fence 12, at 1416. Old Tunnel Mausoleum Wall 17. Graveyard Fence 7. If you can't get in that one. You will encounter two enemies. Choose a skill for finesse. Use a miss on Blue Craze Becker at full health. Choose a skill for when at Rihanna's attack. Fire Bolt. Use Fire Bolt on Blue Craze Becker. <laughs> Do the skill for Sister Alexia, hands of healing. Light of purity, hands of healing. You don't have enough, not light of two plus weapon. Use item. Which item will you use? Eat potion of greater healing, one of three. Use the potion of greater healing on blue. Chris, slightly human, and be honest, at full health. Chris, Sister Alexia, slightly wounded. Do the skill for Chris, attack. Finesse, Grace Better, critically wounded. Do the finesse, Warrior Strike. Use Warrior Strike on blue, Grace Better, critically wounded. Do the skill for human, and be honest, use attack on blue, Grace Better, critically wounded. Grace Better, and both Grace Better, critically wounded. <laughs> Choose a skill flight of purity. Use light of purity on Duke, choose a repeat, you ran from the enemy. Yes. Apple Watcher 1728, Edge 28, Map Boundary 29. Graveyard Fence 0, Edge 13, Map. Apple Watcher. Graveyard Fence 21, as far as I can see 30. Apple Watcher 314, Edge 14, Map Boundary 15. End of Apple Watcher 3, Okado Mausoleum Wall 4. Edge. Tombstone 1. Head 6. Volcano Mausoleum Wall 4. Head. Volcano Mausoleum Wall 4. Head 0. Map Graveyard Fence 0 2. Head. Graveyard Fence End of Axe. You have encountered 1 enemies. Repeat. Choose the skill for command and Rihanna's attack. Repeat. Examine and repeat. You ran from the enemy. Leaving Apple Orchard. Graveyard Fence 22. As far as I can see 30. Graveyard Fence 16. At 18 20. Lunero Mausoleum Wall 20. Graveyard Fence 0, Fillin' Court Mausoleum Wall 9. Graveyard. No. Duck on 916. Graveyard Fence 0, Duck. No. You will make repeat. Choose the skill for repeat. Choose the skill for repeat. Choose the skill for sister, let repeat. Choose the skill for Chris, repeat. Choose the skill for repeat. repeat. Choose the skill for Sister Alexia, hands of healing, light of purity. Use light of purity on blue, shuffling bowman, and full health, and full health, shuffling bowman, and choose the skill for Chris, the best. Use the best on blue, shuffling bowman, choose the skill, fire bolt, use fire bolt on. Choose the skill for Sister Alexia, hands of healing, use hands of healing on blue, Chris, slightly wounded, and be honest, and full health, Sister Alexia, slightly wounded, Chris. Choose a skill for Chris, attack, use attack on blue, shuffling bowman, Chris, choose a skill for Gwen and Rihanna, use it. Choose a skill for Sister Light of Purity. You don't have enough mana, hands of you don't have enough light of plus weapon. You don't have enough use item, rest, choose a skill for Chris, attack, finesse, use finesse on blue, shuffling bowman, choose a skill for use attack. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia, and light of two plus weapons item. Rest, choose a skill for this. Warriors, use warriors. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia, and rest. Choose a skill for Sister Alexia, and of healing. Repeat, examine, examine, and rest. Choose a skill for Chris, attack, use attack on blue, attack, and full health. Choose a skill for Gwen and Rihanna's, a fire bolt, use fire bolt on. There is my health. It missed. <laughs> Choose a skill for Sister Alexia, hands of light of pure, plus weapon. Use plus weapon on blue, Chris, slightly. Choose a skill for Chris, attack. Use attack on. Hey, it worked. Battle log, you won. Item to see. Item to Sister Alexia has reached level 4. Level up, Chris. Level 4, command, not Sister Alexia. Level 4, level 1, Sister Upgrade skills. Upgrade skills. Sister Alexia has 1 expertise. Melee attack, 1 expertise. Ranged attack, 1 expertise. Light of purity, rank 2. 1 expertise. Enhanced focus, 2 expertise. Pacifist, 2 expertise. Exorcist, plus weapon, hands of healing, rank 4. 1 expertise. Purchase skill for 1 upgrade skill. Sister Alexia has 0 expertise. And level up, Sister Alexia. Level set attributes, 1 points available. Assign the previous. Constitution 7. Press left Constitution measure 8. You have 0. Are you sure you want to keep? Level up, Sister Alexia. Level up, Sister. Which file LP1 LP? Game save. Small gate. Entering pad. Leaving pad. Pat 3 file.
Echo Pack. Gate 14. Echo Pack 0. Graveyard Fence 2. Lanero Mausoleum Wall 2. Gate 12. Echo Pack 1. Graveyard Fence 2. Matranus Mausoleum Wall 9. Gate 12. Leaving Pack. Press the Echo Pack. Echo Pack 1. Echo Pack 1. Echo Pack. You will encounter four enemies. Choose a skill for Chris. Attack, repeat. You are from the enemy. Yeah, I want to get out of there. I don't want to fight. I got to end the episode pretty soon. That's so. 17. Map number. Gotta find the fence to my left. Leaving fast. No! You will encounter three. You are from the enemy. I don't want to fight right now. Small case zero. Thank you. Well, there's no mausoleum wall five. City wall 12. Lidario. City West. Discovered Lidario Mausoleum. Okay. Which file created a new LT1, LT2. Can't save. So here we are. We found the first mausoleum that we can uh, investigate. So I'm going to end the episode here, guys. Um, sorry about the technical difficulties, and I really appreciate you guys being patient with me. This next go around should be a lot smoother and a lot more entertaining. See you guys.